folks. I'm Lucy, this is Ethel. Do not adjust your screen. This is all in black and white today and you are watching the latest, most captivating episode of RuPaul's Drag Race. Groundbreaking. Groundbreaking. RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review. And we're gonna be tuning and booting the looks from the main stage of season eight of All right, this week's episode is very, very interesting. I am excited to see what the bitches are wearing because yes. all the looks are based on Detox's look from the reunion episode that happened a few seasons ago. You season know, five. Season five. So they had to create a look that looks as though they walked right through the screen of a movie or a TV show mm -hmm. that is filmed and telecast in black and white. That means they had to paint their body. Right. They had to create a look. They mm -hmm. had to, everything needed to be black and white. I wonder if black and white, your hair will look like red. I don't know. I don't think so. I think it would just be kind of like. Why that's a weird fucking question. Well, it's already black and white. Oh my God, you're so fucking stupid. <laughs> I think you're the dumbest person I've ever met. Let's talk about some looks. Shall we? This one, we actually get to see their face mm -hmm. and comment on the makeup because that's a very integral part of this challenge. Anyway, here we go. Let's look at look number one. We've got Bob. That's Bob. That's in, Bob. In white face. Oh yes, I love it. Gray face. It's all 50 shades of gray. Just gonna say I fucking love it. I absolutely I love it. I fucking love it. Mm -hmm. I maybe put a white pump on the opposite side or I don't that know. That would have been cool. Is... The paint job is phenomenal. It's blended beautifully. I kind of wish that her makeup looked like this all the time in uh, some ways. I mean, I already say it, I said it out loud. This is, I think, the most beautiful she's looked. And you know what I love too is the contrast in the circles of the polka dots and the diamond shape that's in yes. there. And I like that. I like when you mix the two patterns together. I and think she's she wearing great. gloves with nails on a bitch. I love it. Work. Fantastic. I give this look a two. Two. All the way. Yes. Yes, oh God. Now we have Derek Berry. She is wearing an outfit that actually kind of changes into something. There was like a reveal. So she started off with this sort of black dress, a short dress, and then she revealed and there she was in a white gown which I think is a great idea. Especially for Derek, because what mm -hmm. we've seen most of the season, everything's been kind of the same leotard with a skirt or something wrapped around it. So mm -hmm. this is stepping out of the box. I'm shocked. I like the reveal. I like the fact that, you know, there's the surprise element, which is fun. It's her stepping out of the box, but the makeup is a little meh. This looks like Britney Spears in black and white. But you know what? All that aside, I'm just gonna go ahead and give this outfit a two because I, I like I like the reveal. I like that she did step out of her box, and I'm sure it was a, bit, a huge challenge for her. And I'm gonna give this a two. Next we have Naomi Smalls, and she is wearing your outfit. Yes, <laughs> is that right? Did yeah. I see, how did I know that? I don't. That I is never... the finale look from season two. <laughs> I'm going to toot this look because I've seen it before, and I, I think it's a beautiful look, and, and I knew exactly who made that outfit and I love it, so it does get a toot, but I am very disappointed. I mean, it's already been seen. It's like, you know. So? It would've been fun to use it in a music video. But it's not like there's four queens on the main stage in the same fucking look. Oh my God, you're so right. The only thing that's kind of throwing me off a little bit is the discoloration of the legs and the upper body. I wish the bottom was a little more of that off grayish white color, mm -hmm. but the makeup is amazing. It's amazing. It's on fleek. Yes. It's on fleek. Do people still say on fleek? Or I is don't that kind of tired now? It was tired a long time I know. Ago. I'm sorry I said it. We're old. I'll never do it again. I think she looks beautiful. I love this outfit. I give it a toot. All the way. Toot! Yes. But that bitch padded. She did pad. Bravo. Look at you, Naomi Smalls, with some booty. Her, I mean, her booty's beautiful anyway, but. But look at that. Yeah, it all looks good. That's a stank booty right there. Mm, horrible. Next we have kimchi. Kimchi. I adore this outfit. I love it. I don't know what the reference is, where it came from, but it's giving me like goth clown. I think that this was taken a little too literal. You think so? It just looks black and white. It, and maybe it looks more like a black and white cartoon mm -hmm. than a black and white film, but the detail in that makeup is Gorgeous. This look gives me maybe like 
early 1920s German impressionistic uh, silent film called The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari. All the lines are very linear and everyone is sort of painted that way. So that's what I see. I think maybe, well, maybe Kim, that's... Kimchi's a nerd, so she probably knew that probably, or something. Yeah, and I love this. It's cool because it's very two-dimensional. Yeah. And that's what I like about it. And I think that sort of painting in, in drag right now is a big, huge movement mm -hmm. of just kind of doing things that are more artistic and linear rather than blend, blend, blend. So I like it, and I'm gonna give this a two. I give it a two. Mm -hmm. I just wish the skirt was a little longer. Mm. But that's it. Mm -hmm. Next up, 44. I don't really care for this. I love the look, but for this challenge, I do not. I think the look is cool. I think it needed a little help in the makeup department for me. I think the eyes should have been a little bit darker and smokier and kind of given me this sort of like 80s rock and roll. But uh, it's it's a little simple pimple for me. I'm not really feeling it. And again, I wish maybe that the tights would have been more of a, an off-white or a gray. For, for this challenge, black and white, walking out of a, a, a black and white film, this looks like someone walking around with just gray makeup on. Yeah. <laughs> if I had the opportunity to do a black and white challenge, it probably would have been much more dramatic than this. And I know Thorgy has the potential to do something cooler. So I'm gonna boot it. Fuck me. I know. Next we have Chi Chi. And she's going for more of the glamorous life. To me, it's very Morticia. It's very gothic mm -hmm. and horror mm -hmm. than it is like, beauty and glam. This, to me, in the makeup department is a fail. It's way, 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 way too light, and it looks more white than it does black and white gray. This dress is pretty. I love the fur. The hair is pretty. And I love the jewelry. I just don't care for the makeup. I see that what you're talking about with the makeup, that there's a little bit of a disconnect. Like it doesn't have enough shades of gray to give you that gradation or the realness of it. But I think overall, head to toe, I see the look. I get it. I mean, it's glamorous. The jewelry looks beautiful. I love the little uh, tuft of fur across the arm. I'm gonna I, give think it a, I think beautiful. she looks beautiful. I think she beautiful. I think, I mean, I could definitely pick out some other people who don't look as great. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this a two. I give it a two. I just wish that there was a little more attention to detail in the makeup. That's all I'm saying. No. <laughs> it's a two. Two. Our top two of the week is Bob the Drag Queen. Bob. We actually get to say it this week. Bob, Bob, Bob the Bob, motherfucking Bob, drag queen. Bob, 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 Bob. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Bob my knob. Bob my knob. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Boop. <laughs> Trend alert! Geometric shapes, geometry. Geometry. Dragometry. Triangles, circles, squares, parallelograms, <laughs> rectangles, octagons. Yes. <laughs> Want to see these outfits live and backstage? We'll tune in every Tuesday morning to Wow Presents on YouTube and check out Untucked RuPaul's Drag Race Season 8. You Don't forget to subscribe to WOW Presents!